Welcome to Seashorn Vlog. It's our first night at Hor Halloween Horror Nights in Universal Orlando and we're outside Rick Desk because we're in the stained screen of Blumhouse. What are you excited for? Halloween Horror Nights. Yes, I'm feeling a bit blue. Just a bit. You could have got dressed up. I could have, but I'm saving that for the next time. Hello. So we're in the queue and the queue is moving now, heading for the first I'm house. I'm excited. Sean's super excited. Super, super, super excited. That's a nice queue. <laughs> Natalie, get in the bin. Someone's just come up and said hello. It was my biggest fan. Your biggest fan? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think my heart's made for this. No, you jumped out a lot and you were jerking me thing when you jumped. It was funny. Oh, oh, oh. It was scares. funny. <laughs> freaky, freaky was a bit freaky and black phone I don't understand, but a couple of scares in there. It was all right. Yeah. 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 It's going to be funny. more. I was laughing more at you getting fright because you were like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> You're just, you're, you're immovable. I, I, you're a stone. I'm like, I just laugh. It was really good. For my first ever house, have I never done a one before? It was really good and I seemed to get all of the fights. You did, you kept ramming my heels. Yeah. Well, that was the driver. Yeah. Because I can't see in the dark very well. So he didn't know where he was going. He kept wheeling us in the walls and then at the back of Sean's legs. And then when he was getting a fight, he was jerking us and knocking us into like hot props and everything. It was all right, Sean. You know what's needed? A drink. Welcome to Bugs Live 2.0. This is the one you're most looking forward yeah, to. Bugs eating live. This is the one that will actually get me, I think. I'll be shocked if it doesn't get us. The, the team member's quite funny. I hate Bugs, yeah. He yeah. says Bugs Live 2. Bugs Live 2.0, but Free they hugs. do it better than Disney. Mm. <laughs> Free hugs with Bugs. Yeah. What did you think of the Bugs house then? I think the anticipation of it was worse than the actual house. The house was, there was nothing. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. I mean, I was a little bit apprehensive, but not really. Um, it was fairly disappointing, I thought, actually. I was actually expecting there to be a lot of, a lot more bugs, wasps, ants, whatever. Um, but yeah. Someone enjoyed it. Yeah, um, I think the most, the most uh, thing I got was you banging into the walls. Yeah, yeah, it was, like, I, I liked the, I liked a couple of bits, the dangly spider's webs and the pitch black dark bit. But it's, uh, it's difficult pushing you, because you, I can't do yeah, that. Yeah, I, can't I think it was very I don't want to bang your feet. I think it was very difficult in that one for uh, both yeah. yourself and Matt, because you, you, it was just far too dark. Far too dark. Yeah, but it, you know, cleverly done. Um, cleverly done. I think that's the whole point, is that they're cleverly done. Um, but for something that's meant to be a bugs house, you would expect, I don't know, I just expected more bugs. Live cockroaches all over your face. Not live, no. No, anyway, we're waiting for the weekend. It is Sunday, but we're waiting for the weekend. <laughs> um, and yeah. that's the next house that we're gonna do. So we'll tell you about that one in a minute. Um, and we're probably gonna grab a drink and something to eat as we go around tonight, so. It's all, we're also waiting for it to get a little bit darker. And then we can do so the, we can scare the scare zones, scare zones. properly. Yeah, they'll be fun. The weekend house is my favourite out of the three so far. Didn't really get any scares, but I just loved how it was themed, especially that bit in the middle and then that other bit near the end. But I don't want to spoil it, so if you haven't been yet, um, let's just say I look scary in a mirror. Um, but uh, yeah, really, really enjoyable. The music, the set design, fantastic. What do you think, Cass? I thought it was really good. Uh, the straw bin was a bit too much, but I really like the theming and I love the... I can't say the bits that I love either because I don't want to upset anyone. Don't want to get any spoilers. So we get some food and a drink instead yeah. then? But it was good. Yeah. Our mummy's cursed sugar cookie. And they give us an extra one for free because they messed up the order. And 
a tinsel town cocktail which has got like bourbon and cherry bitters and stuff like that. Well, it's cherry brandy, not cherry bitters. You got both. That's it. I didn't see the bitters bit. That's quite nice. I quite like that. Let's try some cooking. Oh, it's soft. I was expecting it to be hard. Is it like cookie dough? It's a soft sugar cookie, but spooky. Look who we've bumped into. Oh. Hi. Hi, everyone. All the way from and the Seuss. Pond. Hi. Hi. Yacht. Trudge TV. We're in the queue for Monsters Legends now. Let's see what this one's like. The journey has been long, but nears its end. Each night as the moon grows larger, I am reminded of... That house was all right. That house was alright, all the music's going on behind because the Lagoon show is going on, which we're, we're going to check out but um, at some point. But the Monsters Collider didn't really get many frights, although Dracula did get me. They were mostly happening behind me. I got all the frights that appears. Yep. Did you, Matt? Did you get frightened? He got a couple. He's ready for his bed. He's I've ready for his bed. No, I've got a nervous disposition, so I get a fright from anything for you. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> you got a fright. <laughs> Is it time for a scare zone? <laughs> 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 I think they're still good fun. We've got a lot more houses and scares on to do. Yeah. We've still got another six to go. Love all the music though. The music's always good. Really good. I will no longer rest in the shadows. I have taken root and will now accept your praise. I am the Pumpkin Lord. How 
was he racing, man? Oh, oh, what is, what? What? You meant to use a straw, not your trunk? Use a straw? Yeah. How you, that makes it really hard to drink if you don't get a straw. Yeah. What flavor? Wild cherry. Wild cherry. We're just having a chill because it very is busy. very, very busy. Very busy. The queue times are really long. Like, it's 20 minutes, half an hour if you want a refill of your cup or, or some food, never mind the houses. And the scare mazes are so full of people, it's hard to, to see anything really, but it's still good. Yeah. It's still good, just super busy. I'm looking forward to this one. What's uh, the Hell Cell Block? Hell Block? Hell Block? Cell Block? Oh, yeah. We'll let you know if it's any good. Hell Block Horror. That's Hell Block Horror, that's the next one. We'll let you know if it's any good. The little food village that they've got here next to Finnegan's is pretty cool as well. Lots of, lots of options. Lots of options. Lots of options. Thanks, Matt, you've got the pepperoni skull. Oh. Yeah, that looks great. It looks good, but smells, does it taste good? It smells good. Give us a Hellfire review. You enjoy that while we're watching people getting scared in this scare zone. Changed the scare actor, so there was a little bit of uh, gaps in, in the house, and then we just went through the sweet tooth scare zone, which is pretty good. But now Caroline wants cauliflower meets locker. Some chicken offals. I hope it's not awful. Let's give these offals a try. Smells good. It tastes good. Oh, really nice spice. Really nice. Like the spice is a really nice spicy flavor. Tomato. That's good, I'd recommend that. 9.99. As the storm builds outside, you bravely decide to enter the dark and decrepit house. Welcome to the lion's den, temptation's on its way. Welcome to the house of fun. Oh! 
was ghoulish. It was very ghoulish. Yeah. We've just watched the ghoulish show. Yeah. That, that, that was that was good. That was decent. It was, it Some was good all, music in there. It was all right, yeah. Yeah, it was all right. Um, the chicken offals in the meat street. You should get them. They did, I don't know what they did with the chicken, but it was crispy, soft. It was it was good. It was like random bits of meat. And I really enjoyed my cauliflower. It was. Both of them were really spicy. It was spicy, crunchy, with an Asian fusion taste. It was yeah. really nice. I enjoyed it. Now we're just chilling out besides Mel's dying. Um, before, well, Matt and Natalie are sorting themselves out in the toilet and then we're going to head over to... What's the house we're doing? El Chupa, Block? Chupacabra. El Block? No, Chupacabra. Oh, we've, we've done oh, that one. Yeah. We're getting really, really I'm tired, tired now. I'm really, really tired. tired. It's like... Virgin on midnight. It's 23, 27. I'm, I'm tired. It's been a long, warm day. Uh, and yeah, we're going to go and do Chupacabra. So that's the next house we're doing. We'll tell you what we're thinking about. That's the end of our first night at Halloween Horror Night. I've had a good night. I'm very, very tired now though. On your last legs, love, you? Yeah, well, I'm on my knees at the moment. But <laughs> I'm, I'm very tired. It's been, a, been a, it's been a good night. There's been some good houses, some not so good houses. The last one, Chupacabra, wasn't great, but that wasn't anything to do with the house. That was the people behind. The just teenage girls were just screeching, ridiculous. Screeching and running at, running at yeah. you. <laughs> Screaming in my ear when there was nothing going on. They were just, just being ridiculous, climbing the walls and grabbing the scenery and stuff. They were, they were ridiculous. Anyway. We'll not end on it. We'll not end on a bad note. It has been it has been a good night. Some good company, some good drinks, some good scares, some good fun. Food. Yeah, some good food. We well, are going to come back for another night, so you'll see that in a future vlog, um, as well as how to scream at SeaWorld. But for now, keep making memories. Catch you later. See you in the next.